Hi, I'm Freddie DeMarco for Black Star Potential, and this lesson will be for beginners and dialing in clean sounds. So I'm on an ID Core 100. The ID series features six different amp voices, two of which are clean. So there's a warm clean and a bright clean. The warm is more American sounding, a fat bottom and very clean, whereas the bright it's kind of has a little bit of an attitude to it, a really cool chime. They often call it a British clean or a boutique style clean. So this chime has a bit of grit in it and it's very cool. It's cool to have both these at our disposal. I'm on the warm clean and I have a little bit of reverb dialed in. So when you bring in the reverb, there's different choices of them. For right now, just a spring would be fine. That's what I have on here. And I'm just dialing in a little bit of it. So you hear it, it's inspiring to play on, but yet it's not washing out your signal. So something like this. <laughs> Now I'm going to add a little bit of delay to that. So we're on the warm with the reverb, but adding some delay, the delay will add repeats, like little echoes. We don't want that very loud, so keep the level knob down. You'll hear the repeats. That'll add some ambience. Sometimes you don't even notice that when you're playing, but if you didn't have it, it would be drier. Check it out. Now, we have a choice of different modulation effects on this amp. I'm going to choose a chorus. The chorus adds somewhat of a doubling effect, so this should be a really soothing, lush sound, being a bit of reverb, a bit of delay, and chorus all working together. Let's move over to the bright clean. So this would have a little bit more grit to it. Check this out. And I will bring out the, let's see, the delay and the chorus. So we're left with just reverb. Now I can add some delay to this and make it a slap back. So I'll tap tempo very quickly so it doesn't echo boom, 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 boom. It's bup, 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 bup. And this is used a lot in country, some blues, and in rockabilly. It has a really cool repeating effect. I'll bring up the level to exaggerate it. Like a country player might do this kind of a lick. If you're not chicken picking just yet, it's still cool to use for country music and chording where you get that slapback type effect. Okay, we're back on the warm channel with a little bit of chorus, a little bit of reverb, and I'll show you some different styles and things that can be done with the clean sound. For example, one of them's a funk type sound where it's very percussive, a real fast right hand. That chorus is a nice little ambient effect and the reverb really puts you in a nice room. Clean sounds are also very nice just for chording, like kind of like a folky type thing. Something like this would be very nice with just a clean and keeping the level down in terms of gain. So don't have your gain very loud when you're dialing in these clean tones because we don't want them to crunch. If you do, you can get a really nice crunch off these clean sounds, but for all intents and purposes, right now we just want to have a nice clean tone, so gain lower and then turn your actual amps volume up a little bit louder. Another nice thing to do with a clean sound is play chords mixed with melody notes, like scale notes, and kind of double up on chords versus melody. I do have a delay and reverb on the warm channel for this one. 
this kind of a thing. Hey, thanks for joining me for this Black Star lesson on dialing in clean tones. Thank you.